I think the biggest thing that, that I've learned is to focus on areas where there are either major problems or where uh, there isn't the flow of capital or there isn't the investment. I think today in our affordable investment business, one of the things that we find is that most affordable apartment communities, it was a very highly fragmented industry where a lot of small operators that didn't necessarily bring the strategic uh, best practices of the apartment industry to those sectors. We take a real holistic view to investing in affordable communities, not only investing in brick and mortar, but we do things like after school programs and things like that, where it invests in our residents as well. You know, so you can always bring innovation to a, to a sector that seemingly is very, very mature. The important thing that, the, the, that my generation of leaders have to do mm. is step back more, delegate more, and you know, I spend more of my time now as a coach and facilitator, and I still lead the organization, but I'm continuing to push more leadership down to that next level. I learned a long time ago, someone told me about leadership, and, and they said, you know, there's generally three things that can happen when you delegate. One is they're gonna do exactly the same thing, and whatever the outcome, is gonna be the same outcome. Sometimes they're gonna do the, something different, and it may have a better outcome, and then sometimes they're gonna do something that's different, it's gonna have a bad outcome. But you've gotta allow, the, when you really think about it, two out of three of those possibilities are good, so why not do it? The most important thing, we have the, I, the same view of what uh, our property should be about relative to our residents. You know, one of the things that helps, I try to walk our communities frequently. You know, you'll walk a property and you'll get stopped because people will think you're a maintenance person and they'll stop and they'll tell you what's uh. going on and they'll say, and, and there have been times people have stopped me and said, can you look at something in my apartment? Sure, and I talk with them and I'll go look at right. whatever it is. And Now have you ever fixed anything? Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> absolutely. It's a hands-on business, you know, that's just what we do. You, you have to have escapes in addition to being focused, you know, 24/7 on business cuz you, you know, you have to rejuvenate yourself. I try to tailor my outside involvements to be tied to either activities business-wise or things that I enjoy personally. <music>